Good morning, everyone. Campbell Marshall starting your 4th of July weekend on this Saturday, about 95 degrees. Let's call that toasty, shall we? It's going to be a little bit warmer on Sunday with those feels like temperatures between 105 and 110 degrees. It's going to be a little bit drier in terms of actual chances for rain, but that heat index is going to be quite high Monday, 96 degrees, going to be in mid 80s by 9 o'clock on Monday on 4th of July. Heat index could be even higher on that day. We look out for a heat advisory at some point. This afternoon, high Temperatures 95 in Conroe, Navasota, 94 in Belleville, Bush Intercontinental, close to 95 degrees as well. I think 89 in Galveston for your high temperature. But the high temperature, the actual high temperature, is not as important as the heat index. It feels like temperature. Where later on this afternoon, 104, 103 degrees. And if you look forward tomorrow, even by 10 or 11 o'clock, it's going to feel like 100 degrees on Sunday. Going into the afternoon, even warmer. 105, 106 degrees is not going to be uncommon. Exact track radar working. So far today, not really finding much at all. A couple of little light showers that came through Galveston earlier this morning. We'll have a chance for some showers later on this afternoon, but right now, boy, the beach looks nice. Galveston down on the Pleasure Pier. The beach has no water advisors as well, so that's a good thing to think about. By the way, on the uh, Memorial Day, they'll have the uh, parade on 37th Street at Seawall. Lots going on down there. Temperature will be warm, but not much in the way of any kind of rain. Planning on taking the boat out. Wind from the southwest about 5 to 10 miles an hour. Bays are smooth to a light chop later this afternoon. Swells, not much of an issue either. Low tide is this morning. Uh, high tide is going to be a little bit afternoon. 89 degrees, the high for Galveston. The water temperature about 87. You should notice that the UV index is very high. Rip current risk is moderate to high as well today. So be careful it's gonna, if you're going to be going out there. Future cast model put this in motion and shows the showers that have already gone through and by later on this afternoon shows a little bit more going about two to three o'clock picking up and then waning by the time we get to five o'clock and then it kind of dissipates as we go through the overnight hours. Going to the Astros game first pitch is at 310 at four o'clock it's going to be like 95 degrees six o'clock 92 88 degrees at eight o'clock when they come up with another win. Dynamo playing. They're starting. Their game is at 8 o'clock. Still hot and humid when they're doing their tailgating at uh, 6 o'clock. By 8 o'clock, it's going to feel like 98 degrees. They, too, we suspect will come up with a win. How about that? Here's your 10-day look at the forecast. In slight rain chances both today and tomorrow. I think that Sunday, 20% should be more like 10. I may change that at some point. But you should know that no matter what that temperature is, you need to feel like there's a heat advisory in place. There isn't one, but you should drink plenty of water, rest, and stay inside as much as possible. But when you're outside, take plenty of breaks. Hot holiday, 4th of July, going up to about 98 degrees by the end of the week. Only slight rain chances throughout. Enjoy.